morning dear students i welcome you all in your mathematics class in this video we are going to discuss about the use of measurement in our daily life have you familiar with the words heavier or lighter we often compare the things with the words tall taller tallest and short shorter shortest and many more we measure different things in a different manner we use different units for measurement to measure height length and width weight time long distance capacity temperature time and many other things further we measured fruits vegetable pulses in grams and kilograms to measure weight we use weighing balance and digital weighing machine here you can see the normal weights which are used to weigh the things in weighing balance here is a picture of spring balance which is used to measure the heavy weights hey kids this is a picture of weighing scale or bathroom scale with the help of these we can monitor our weight we know that liquids take the shape of container capacity usually refers to the amount of liquid a container can hold measuring jars come in different capacities liquids are always measured in liters and milliliters we can measure the capacity of a tiny bottle of perfume or a big tank of petrol earlier people used parts of the body for measuring the lengths for example hand span cubit fathom but it has two main objections the first one is units will be different when measured by different people the second one is various units has no connection with each other for example hand span cubit fathom are not related to each other later on units like feet and inches were used to measure the height and distance now all over the world metric system is accepted the instrument we used in metric system for measuring length width and height are ruler scale meter stick measuring tape etc so in measurement when we measure the length we get the answer for the question how long when we measure the height we get the answer for the question how tall when we measure the capacity we get the answer for the question how much a container can hold and when we measure the weight we get the answer for the question how heavy is the thing thank you children enjoy learning